Kaka boop a pee pee. All right. Okay. Let's see. Hold up. I'm I'm thinking about another color today. Let's see what other colors we can do. I like blue. Blue looks pretty interesting right about now. Hmm. Suits me. Suits me. I like this. Let's keep it. Why not? Why not? Sounds like a good time. Sounds like a fantastic time. Okay, so what we're gonna do? Put this. Can I put this over? I can't. It's so unfortunate. My head is a little bit cold. Okay. Um. Hmm. Can't really customize anything as Virgil, so <laughs> I guess I'll just uh hop right into it. Why not? Welcome everybody, by the way, whoever is watching. Thank you for being here. I got another mod to completely replace uh, V as Virgil. So you guys will be happily surprised to see something like that. Yeah. Time for some payback. What? Did my game just bug out? You know what? They said on certain missions that you shouldn't play as Virgil. So, maybe this was one of them. Well, guys, thanks for dropping by. Just kidding. I'm I'm going to I'm going to start it up again, but you guys are just going to have to give me a sec. That's so stupid. That it doesn't like I don't know. Well, I mean, if that's the case, then I can, I can at least, at the very least, throw on some, um, some co-op. All right, yeah, just give it a second, guys. It's loading up right now. Yeah, they, they said in the readme files that, uh, a couple of missions, I think, I think it has to do something with mission 13. Um, you can't play as Virgil. There was another mission, um that I played that wouldn't allow me to actually do that as well. I'm not sure. Nice. Need more power because this shit just crashed. Dude, playing as Virgil was too fucking much for my computer to handle. Just took a huge fucking dump on me. That's great. All right, well, it's like I said, I guess we're, um, if we're not, if we're not going to be able to play as Virgil, I might as well do co-op. Maybe we'll find a person who's uh, doing co-op on the same mission. Who knows? Be pretty cool. But we're going to have to play for Nero on this one. And then for the next one, we, we can see if uh, if we can... Whatchamacallit. But I mean, it's okay. You know, I, I don't really mind. It shit happens. As long as you guys understand. <laughs> That's what makes a, a, a huge difference. AC connecting the network. Maybe we'll be able to find some. No, no, this fucked it up too. Motherfucker. And it's like, I can't, I can't just back out. I can't back out to the next. Good job, Chico. Thank you. All right, guys. Well, we're just not, do we're doing this, this mission fucking basic. Because apparently, apparently my, my, uh, my game cannot handle. So first it was the Virgil mod and now it was the, um, the co-op, the virgins thingamajiggy, which is unfortunate. We're just going to have to play through this mission. Very, uh, very vanilla. So, that's okay. I don't mind. I don't mind playing as Nero. What the fuck? No, 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 no. It, it actually bugged out my game like this. Like, for real, for real. I, I don't even have the trainer on. Hold up. Well, let me, let me actually just close the trainer altogether. Because, for some reason, it's like, it's really, really bugging out. There shouldn't be an issue. Okay, it's done. It's closed. And it's starting up again. 
I'm sorry so much for the for the delay, guys. I I really am. I don't know why this is happening. It's kind of funny, but you think you could bring me up on your? Just have me, you know, just be lurking in the chat. Yes, I know. This is like the thirtieth time I've started. It. Let's let's actually manually start. Hello, Erun. What's up, Lexi? How are you doing? Welcome. So, as you guys can see, I am going to be doing this Demon King on Dante Must Die. So you guys know for the future. You know, we can we can watch the cutscene. Why not? Why not? There's there's nothing to it. Lexi, how are you feeling today? No point thinking about it. How's your day been so far? I'm Demon King. Perfect timing. Now we're starting. He really just stood there and fucking took it. He was like, "Yeah, you know what? If I die, I die." <laughs> Finally, vibing, bro. That's good. Let's go. Hello, Demon King Lauren. Damn, she really just called you Lauren, Lauren. You gonna take that? You gonna take that disrespect? Obviously, we're doing Super Nero. <laughs> yeah, you can't say that. I don't have any magazines. Are you kidding me? All right, well, I guess we're customizing then. Hello again, everybody, one and all. Thank you for dropping by. I hope you guys are uh, enjoying the show so far, even though there's not a lot of show right now. <laughs> hmm. Maybe a tomboy, and then another punchline, and then another ragtime, and then another. That looks good to me. I like this set. Punchline is my best friend. As Nero, it's it's like one of the best crowd controls. I swear, it's amazing. I'm not gonna be talking as much because I got an essay to write, but I'll still be here. Ooh, woo. thank you, Lexi. It's like I said, honestly, you know, like if you're busy, I don't, I don't expect you to always be available, you know, 24 seven. Just the fact that you come in here and say hi, it means a lot to me. All right, let's run it. These demons are about to get the dickens. Just you wait, you big bastard. All right, so I'm gonna do a pro gamer move. I'm gonna run right by these guys. Jesus. Eh. Eh. You guys are none of my concern. Leave me alone. Ah, this is where the fun begins. You know what? I should I probably should have been charging up my um Come on. These guys live forever. All right, finally. Oh lord, I hate the fucking furies, bro. Stop. 
Stop fucking moving. Come on, come on. <laughs> I'm just gonna keep on doing this. He can't possibly hit me. Come on. Ah. Ah. <laughs> I can't hit him. <laughs> He's too fast. <laughs> I hate the fury. Stop moving so much. I hate my life. Thank God. Vagina? Game is a little slow. Wait, what? <laughs> that was a weird looking vagina. <laughs> Sweet Lord. Uh, the Furies always get me, bro. The Furies are always the biggest pain in the ass to deal with. Because they just move so fast and they teleport. The, the only thing they do is teleport. And then they just... Hide from you. They do that the entire match. <clears throat> Unless you really, really study exactly when they're coming in. It's almost impossible. To fight them. Like, and, and just keep up a, a good score. I mean, I'm sure people... I'm sure really top tier expert players have been able to um, to accomplish finding out how to to perfectly parry them out of a, a teleport attack, but it's just like I need help. Come on. There we go. You got a little health back, I think. Whoopee! Yeah, guys, you know we're just here, just hanging out. Unfortunately, it's not it's not Virgil, but hopefully, in the next mission we will be able to play as Virgil again without the game just completely taking a big dookie on us, which I think we will. I'm not sure. I think the next mission is a. Um, V mission? I could be wrong. I'm pretty sure it is. Going down is the only way, huh? Yeah, the next mission is a V mission, and then the mission after that is a Dante mission. Alright. Who am I fighting now? Oh, yeah, that's right, this guy. This is the strat. This is the strat, boys. And girls. There are girls here, too. No discriminate. Oh, shit. Oh. Oh. Oh, 
Oh. Man's got bullets, okay. Wow! This guy gave me one swift fucking kick in the nuts. Jesus Christ. Okay, well, how about we, uh... <laughs> how about we just take you out real quick? Virgil is, uh, nowhere to be found right now, as a matter of fact, because the game won't let me <laughs> play as Virgil. Ugh. There we go, sweet mother of Jesus. What a pain in my cooch. Alright, we gotta go this way. Yeah, that one guy took forever to kill. Like, I s <laughs> What a mission. And, you know, use DT, you have full DT. You know what? You're absolutely right, and every time I did it... Every time I thought I was pressing the devil trigger, I was pressing, um... Left bumper. I always forget that uh, Nero's Devil Trigger is is the touchpad. I know. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Edward. I've disgraced the whole family. And sometimes I'm just like these these small things. I'm just not picking up on. I will say this is the first time that I've been playing uh, Devil May Cry in quite some time because I hate my life. Okay. Bye, guys. <laughs> See ya. And then I'm... And I'm free! Free ballin'. Look at that. Easy skips. Oh my god, we have to fight fucking yours in soon. That's right, I completely forgot about that. Oh, we got another fight coming up ahead of us. Alright, sick, sick, sick. Let's start charging now. All oh, the fucking nobodies.
Damn, I missed it. Come on, come on, come on. Fuck! I missed! And he fucking broke my shit. Okay. Hold up. This is not very cash money. Not very cash money indeed. I got fucking rocked. I'm so sorry that I'm being so garbage for you guys right now. But, here's the thing. Here's the thing. I have orbs for days. <laughs> I got orbs for days, so I can fucking- I can full res. Hold up, I'm trying... ...to... There we go. And then, I'm gonna load up. There we go. That works. I don't know why I even activated Devil Trigger for that one. Yeah, I'm, I'm really sorry. Usually, you know, usually I'm a lot better. Or at least I like to think I am. But I'm just like... Uh, usually when I start off a Devil May Cry stream, I'm, I'm like... I'm getting into the flow. And then when I get a little bit deeper into it, then I start getting a little bit better. So I just wanna... I wanna preface this stream with that. Just to let you guys know. I'm not bad. <laughs> I swear I'm not bad. I'm trying my hardest to be as good as possible at this game. I hate the nobodies though. I think they look creepy, and I think their moveset is just a little too unpredictable. And if you guys are wondering if I'm going for the S rank, I've I've already S ranked everything. I've taken the time to um to go and find like all the all the guides, everything that I possibly can. To S rank all the missions, so Dante Must Die is just like I'm playing this right now just for fun. So I'm not I'm not looking to you know S rank anything or or be as crazy good as possible. Right now I really just want to try and play as um as Virgil, but for some reason on this specific mission, if I try to uh, select Virgil as a playable character on um, the co-op trainer, then it bugs out the game and makes the game look at a wall. And then I just like I can't I can't play, um, so unfortunately I have to go through this as Nero. I think the next mission I can actually play as Virgil. I'm not sure because I think if if the next mission is what I think it is, then I might have issues uh, with that as well. Unfortunately. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> You've come here to die. Alright. God damn it. I can't see shit. I've done this before. Although, am I going to be able to do it again? Not sure. This might take a while. <laughs>
All right. Okay, okay. Sick, sick. I like regretting my existence. What if? And this is just a what if. I don't die, and instead I win. I need my devil trigger to heal. Holy mother of Jesus. Oh, I need to- I, Yeah, that's right, I need to actually beat him. That's okay. <laughs> Why not? Fuck it. Maximum amount of orbs. There we go! He was going incredibly fast for that fucking attack, dude. I was like, oh hell no! To the no no no! Demon power does not course through your veins. Yet you try. How dare you strike me? Uh oh, stinky! I just want to see. Dante's double cheeked up fucking devil trigger come in. I will show you your worst nightmares. I will give you despair and death. I don't think so, pal. All right. Ouch. Now, hear me out, guys. Hear me out. Hear me out. What if, what if I actually win this? You see, I said that about the other thing, but <laughs> what if? Ow, okay. Maybe not. Eh. 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 Holy shit. I always forget about that thing. This is Dark Souls, guys. I'm barrel rolling. Knocked me back. He gave me the whole clap. Oh, never mind. <laughs> that wasn't working out. That's okay. That's okay. I didn't need to win, anyways. You think Dungur? No. Nah, yeah. Oh no. I'm sure. I'm sure Dunguri and uh, SS Smoke have. Huh? Oh yeah. <laughs> I'm sure they have most definitely beaten this this giant tentacle asshole. Who dares interfere? 
Oh shit, I wonder who it could be, hmm? Virgin is here, let's go. Willie Morgs one on Snapchat? Damn, I straight snapped his cock in half. I like how they really tried saying, an unfamiliar demon with red go Who else dons red? This fucking much. Damn, that was fucking abysmal. That was, that was okay. I'm, I don't have to try hard, so... I'm fine. I don't have to do anything. Um, Next. Next one. Genesis. So I'm not sure. I don't think this one will work either. Hold up. Let me let me let me check the fucking Let me check the uh DMC5 mod Nexus because if I check it out, they'll probably tell me which missions are available and which aren't. So you guys can enjoy this cutscene real quick. Co-opter, and then they go. This is what I need. Just think. And then it says... One, two, three, four, five... Eight, nine? Are all ruffled. See, she wants to invite you to her birthday party. But your phone is disconnected. <laughs> hmm. You're a smart one, Morrison. You notice the electric and water out, too? I expected nothing less. So what's the good news? Oh, I got a gig. Cash, da, 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 da. Cash up front. This I like. The water needs turning on, and those toilets need flushing. Hmm. Water, gas, and power coming out of your cut. You're a real agency now. I should be able to fight. America's edging right now yeah we we are we are edging right now ladies and gentlemen we, we are close devil may cry like a zillion there's no way not a little kid was patty trying to smash virgil i mean not virgil fucking dante interesting Sounds like half America, half of America is dumb, dumb, stupid heads. It's just both, both. Uh, what the fuck? Wait a minute. Wasn't it supposed to? I got a mod that was supposed to completely change V and make him Virgil. It would have been funny to just see Virgil walk in, fucking lay against the the thing, and then Dante just completely oblivious as to his own brother just walking in after being missing for God knows how many years. So, what's your name? Edge McEdge. I should have gotten the My Little Pony fucking book mod too. Jesus Christ, this would have been so funny. Either option is bad, honestly. Like I, I feel like I feel like. Yeah, it's just I, I we're not we're not into politics. That's yeah. We're not here to talk about politics. We're just we're just here to play games. All right. So let's let's keep it to games. Let's keep it to Devil May Cry. I'm not a big fan of politics. I don't think I don't think any of it is fucking real. I mean, it's real, but it's just like there is no. Yeah, we can do it. We're Virgil. Let's go. Finally. Okay. I just hope my game doesn't crash because I think it crashed one time before. Um. Why do I have Nero's music, but I'm playing as V, but I'm actually Virgil? <laughs> I don't understand what the what the fucking I don't I don't know what the 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 whole situation is here right now. That's kind of funny though. 
No, yeah, see? it's It doesn't change me. That's interesting. What the fuck? He charged me and that hurt me? What the fuck? This dude just burrowed underground? Holy shit! <laughs> Virgil's fucking cringe face is like. Err. All right, all right. Move fast, baby. Don't be slow. Yeah. Let me fucking move. It literally wasn't letting me move. I can't see. Too many effects. There we go, fuck's sake. I hate that giant crocodile piece of shit, because he's just like, it's so unpredictable. <laughs> okay, so what if we... Yoink that. That's right! I can just fucking... Can I get over this? Oh my god, please tell me. Please tell me I can just get over this. What can I explore with this? Are there any secrets? that the game is hiding from me. Like this song? You like this song. You like you like Edge McEdge's song. Mm-hmm. That's that is unfortunately coincidental. There we go. Apocalyptic. <laughs> Could you imagine? They made an announcer. Just make me an announcer. For A, I'll be... Or for... Okay, so hold up, hold up. What would be... What would be my, um... My names? My devil trigger. All right, now I'm, I'm going to need some help. Okay, so, okay, okay, all right. Here's the thing, here's the thing. If I were to be an announcer, let's say, theoretically, it's, it's probably not going to happen, but if it did, what would... It goes from, from D to C to B to A and then to S. What would be my, uh... What would be my, my, my little... 
I don't know how to say it. My thing. What would be my my uh my my words? What would I say? Unbelievable. Ooh, this guy just fucked me. All right, hold on. Let's uh, let us use this real quick because you see, like, it's not letting me move. Ah, I kind of miss like the knockback from a from a, a hit because even though I can tank hits. It like it makes it more difficult because because I don't I don't really feel the weight of hits and I don't really know how much damage I can take. That too, that too. When I when I get uh, parried, I there's such a long cooldown. Here, I'll just fucking. There we go. I'll just keep doing this. Oh! <laughs> this is easy. It's great because I hate the Judecas. They're so fucking annoying to fight. <laughs> I can just do that! Damn, 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 damn. Alright, so it would be. Um. I don't know. I, I, it would have to be something, like, stupid. Uh, hmm. What's a D word that I, that I say a lot? Could be... I say dick a lot. <laughs> dick. I fucking see what could be cock. <laughs> dick, cock, balls, ass. As <laughs> sphincter for as <laughs> America kind of gay, but like it's like I said, we're not here to we're not here to talk about no politics. Politics, we have no control of it, so it's just it's it's better just not to think about it. We're here to play some goddamn Devil May Cry, play some some Virgil mods. We're out here just hanging out, having a good time. I'm drinking coffee. I don't know about you guys. I haven't taken a sip of coffee in like five years, so I, I probably should before it gets cold. There's so many particle effects, I don't know what's going on! There you go. Just take all of these summon swords. I'm just gonna fucking spam it. <laughs> I can't see! And these fuckers killed me! We got Virgil, so it's all good, baby. Bury the light deep with it. <laughs> God damn it, dude. It's like I said, why why am I playing as V, but I'm actually Virgil with Nero's music? Thank goodness. I love this. This is the funniest fucking move. They would not- they would not give Virgil in the main game this move. They would not. They would give him probably the- Dante's uh, trickster equivalent. They have to. Because this is not making it into any- any like vanilla game whatsoever. Have you guys seen the Beowulf gameplay? That shit is sick. That shit is sick. And I think, I think I saw like a spectral, like force edge thing move that he uses that kind of like, um, 
simulates some of, uh... It kind of simulates... It simulates, uh, Dante's weapon moves. Kind of like Rebellion. So it's interesting. Oh my god. Hydrate? Wait, wait, hold up. Hold up, we got a hydrate? We got a hydrate on YouTube? Is it possible? F in the chat? There's nothing like some fresh water to just like course down your esophagus. I love it, dude. I love this. This is the funniest fucking thing. I should probably use this more often. I can't wait for this for this special edition to come out. I mean, it's not it's not going to come out for PC, but we will be able to play as Virgil. They said that. They said that it's going to be coming to PC as a DLC. The only thing it's just like it, special edition is not coming as a whole to PC, but singular DLCs are coming. So I, I mean, it's just like It's not that big of a deal. Hey, I remember you guys. Wow, he killed me during Judgment Cop. Judgment Cop? Goddamn, no cap. I want to listen to V's theme because I haven't heard the whole song. So she does like... She loves Edge McEdge's song. Unbelievable. <laughs> Leave me alone! Holy shit! That's how I do it. There we go. Now I'm a little motivated. 
I'll never be able to replicate uh, Daniel Southworth's virtual. It's just not possible. You can't. It's un. It's unachievable. Oh, are we gonna fight? Hold up. No, we're gonna fight the nobodies. That's right. Okay. I was about to. I was about to fucking shit myself. I was like, dude, there's no way we're gonna fight Cavalier right now. Iris said, scum. The fucking eyeball blew up, bro. I wonder what mascara he wears. It's very noisy. I like V's subtle guy liner. V looks like he has bad lip injections. <laughs> That's fucked up. That's fucked up. I, I did think that too. I, I always thought that his, his lips were like strange. Like it, it was like they were too wide. But they were also, I don't know, kind of thick. It's, it's a strange... Strange combination. Leave me alone. See it, pal. Woo! Let's go! <laughs> he has hot dogs for limbs, too. <laughs> Look at him. Look at this dude. I I was actually kind of curious to see how he would look, how Virgil would look like in these scenes. Because you can, like, a uh, character model replace. Um, man's really said... Well, guys, that was the end of the mission. That was the end of the mission. We did a good job. Triple orb revive. Yeah, I know. I know. I know. It's okay. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm not the best. Me pen su 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 su. What the hell? Crimson Cloud ain't terrible. She likes it. Oh shit! I came back to my baby daddy emo man with tattoos. Hell yeah, you did. Oh, we're going back in time, Mr. Worldwide? Whoa! Is this Eva? Dante's mom? No way. I can't believe it. Mother. So Dante has been in the closet all this time? You must listen to me. Bro. This was the last time he saw his mother, and then he was like, dude, if I don't return, when I'm like in my my mid-twenties, there's I'm pretty sure I'm going to find a, a woman who looks exactly like this, and I'm going to be turned on. <laughs> Am I? Is Lexi simping over V? I don't know. His, that's his name. That's his name. His name is V in this game. That last little scream was all it took for Dante to develop a mommy fetish. Look, there he is, Lexi. There he is. Oh, that little smirk. He's like, yeah, welcome back, Lexi. I was catching up on some light reading. Oh, he fell down. He's so, he's so weak. He's so weak right now. He's gonna, he's gonna cry when somebody milks his soft cow tits. What day is it? And fucking... <laughs> what? What? What was the next one? 
<laughs> no wonder I'm so stiff. Oh, Dante stiff. He was having a dream about his mom. <laughs> he got up. He was like, "Oh, I'm stiff." Hey, this is my gig. Leave Nero out of this. If you could defeat yours, and then I never would have dreamed of using that child. That will be my rise to fame. I'm gonna cosplay as V. Oh my god. Enough of this, Aaron. I will and so. God damn it. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Look at it. He's edging. He's edging right there, bro. Are you kidding me? Hey. Throwback. That's it. That's mother. It looks exactly like his mom, bro. And he has a fucking relationship with her. Like, uh, what? What were they thinking? What were they thinking? I mean, it never, it, like, they never, they never fully show them doing anything like kissing or whatever. But like in Devil May Cry One, in Devil May Cry One, bro, they were like holding each other and looking at each other with like a sort of love that it was just like, uh, cringe. Sweet home Alabama. Fucking mommy fetish, dude. No one special. Who's the girl? Let's go clean up this Which one? There are two girls here. First come, first serve on the targets run. Music to my ears. Hurry up, Dante. This is my man. Guess I get to see it with my own eyes. If it really is you. If it really is you. Virgil. Oh, it's 444? Let's go. Is that Alice Cullen? Bro, that girl is Alice from Twilight. Is it? I don't know if it is. <laughs> I look up, I'm Dante. Pans back down, I'm Virgil. Let's go. I'm here to help, guys. Don't worry. I've done this once before. Can I... Is there any way that I can get past this? No, they probably they probably kept that in mind. Hello? Any more enemies? I need to use my trick more often. There we go. I gotta go. Can't wait to get cyber bullied. Can't wait for you to be dogs. Wait, what? No. Hold up. Dante got no lips. V can't relate to that. V got too much lip. Too much lip and no vocal lessons. I gotta go. Oh, I hope people come here. I got nice. <laughs> Guys, please. No. Stop the violence. Please. Look how fast I'm going, guys. You know, the only bad thing about being faster th than light is that you live in darkness. I could just do- I could do this all day!
Where's this other guy? Stop moving. Let's go! It's not violence, it's just the truth. That's that is true, that is true. You're not you're not saying you're not saying anything technically that like means that you're going to be violent. You're just you're just stating that you have knives in your home. So if anybody wants to come in, you know, they you you didn't say what you're gonna do. You could show them your knife collection, you never know. There we go. Anyone else? Any other takers? Let's go! Smoking sexy style, bro. Slightly stupid stumo. Stumo? <laughs> God damn it. I'm always stuttering and messing up. Oh my god, I have to fight a fury here. Yeah, you can disappear. I can disappear too. What's up? You can't catch me. Oh, maybe he can. Thank God. I did not want to fight that guy. <laughs> I'm speed running right now, dude. You guys can't even see what's going on. I'm too, I'm too fast. I'm faster than light travel. Maybe that's why I make all these noises. It's because I'm moving so fast that I'm just like, I'm too fast. Start things off with a bang. Oh, these motherfuckers got me. Prestigious, why did you stop streaming on Twitch? Oh my gosh, the massive delay between messages is unbearable. That's a one minute delay. That hurts my soul. F. I, I mean, honestly, dude, uh, Twitch was was not taking me to the places where I needed to go. Um, for, for YouTube, if I stream, then not only am I working on my partnership goal, but I'm also getting more people to my channel to see my content because... Um, to become a partner, or to become partnered, rather, uh, you need 4,000 watch hours, and you need, uh, 1,000 subscribers. So if I stream on Twitch, and I also put out videos on my own time of me recording things, like I have a video of, um, of Mass Effect, of my Mass Effect playthrough, that I need to, uh, edit today and put out, and it's probably gonna come out tomorrow, um, stuff like that. If I work, uh, double time on YouTube, then that'll help kind of build up my channel on twitch you only really you know the the main games that are on display are fortnite call of duty apex legends all this other bullshit bo battle royale first person shooter garbage competitive shit i don't want to do all that i just want to like i want to hang out i want to be able to play games like this and and you know have a community to get behind and talk with because uh on twitch you don't you don't find a lot of that people want to see action pvp um, you know, here on YouTube, I feel like there's a community that is more, uh, more willing to see stuff like, like me playing through, through horror games or me playing through story based games, things like that. And, and that's the main reason why I stopped uh, streaming on Twitch. Cause it just like, it just wasn't worth it in my opinion. 
especially for this game, you know, th there was such a small community for Devil May Cry on Twitch, and here I feel like I can get a lot of people, you know, to talk to. And that's something that I think is very crucial for a streamer or a content creator in general is is to have something to to bounce back off of because while yes you know if you're really good you can make your own commentary you can talk with yourself and you can you know go on for hours and sometimes i can do that but it's just a little easier when you have other people in your chat uh replying to you and and giving you something to think about you know kind of uh giving you your mind a, a little a little test a little exercise because you know talking with yourself is all fine and dandy but it, it's just like at one point you run out of things to say and you're just like, okay, what do I do now? Where's this other guy? There he is. All right. That's right, Aaron. Go off, King. I've noticed you got twice as many viewers on here compared on Twitch. I see your point. I don't mind you streaming on YouTube at all. The only thing I ask is if you can trim that delay down a lot. Instead of one minute, maybe 10 seconds or so. Um, I can try. Uh, it's it's a little... Not difficult, but I... I I'm not sure... I don't know. Because I have the option to select low latency... But I feel like with uh, the, the, the lower the latency, the higher the demand for internet connection. And I'm already cutting it close as it is. Um, so I, I'll try it. Maybe I'll try it next stream. As a matter of fact, I don't know. Maybe can I, can I do it now? Can I, is it possible for me to stream latency? Well, I, I, can, I can look into that um, after the stream. Look at this guy. Look at this. Big ol' lava bat. Insanity ablaze. Man, if you don't get your insanity ablaze looking ass. Oh, brother, I gotta fucking... I gotta bounce. Ow! Thank God. Woo, child. So that's interesting. From De uh, Dante Must Die to... Um, or from Son of Sparta to Dante Must Die, they replaced the Impusa Queen with a Fury. Which, I mean, I, I guess it makes sense because it's like... It's like the DMC4 blitz of this game, to be quite honest. Sounds good, yeah. I thought about streaming on Twitch, but I think I'd much rather do it on YouTube. Grow the community, get monetization and stuff, which is far better than maybe one or two Twitch subs. Which, you know, I, I won't lie, you know, Twitch has has allowed me to continue to do content creation because, you know, I've I've been able to meet the requirements for, uh, for payments uh, through, you know, very generous people gifting subs and donating and, and uh, giving bits and whatnot. And I'm thankful for that. I'm forever grateful for that. And I have I have amassed a following. I have around 2,000 followers on Twitch. But uh, at the same, on the same token, you know, barely any of those people come to see my channel. 
So it's it's I'd rather have more people come in and hang out than a lot of people that just kind of ignore me. You know, while while I do appreciate the sentiment of them following me, um, you know, it's just out of two thousand people, I only get three uh, people, maybe concurrently, uh, maybe four, five, such like that. Uh, it, it's just you know, while I am grateful for the people that I've met on Twitch and for the times that I've had on Twitch, I feel like. I, now is time for for me to actually you know do something a little different because maybe this might work a little bit better and it, it feels better oh yeah especially with the the dmc shit that's going on right now on twitch for a lot of big streamers yeah That's ridiculous. <laughs> it's interesting. So apparently, if I get parried... If I get parried like that... Then I have iframes, apparently. I don't know, that's kind of strange. Which actually makes it a little bit better, though. Finally, um, you guys think Virgil will have more or less weapons than he did in uh, DM4 C SE? I think I don't know. Have Have you been able to see the um the the gameplay trailer for Virgil? Because he has Beowulf, he has the katana. Um, I think he has a spectral uh, force edge because I remember seeing a, a a long sword on his back. He's edging, bro. Virgil's edging in the game. That's gonna be his fourth uh, move set. He just fucking, he's about to bust, and then he just like doesn't. But then he builds it up, and then when he actually busts, it just like kills everybody in the room. I mean, fucking, it'll kill me, bro. Getting me? Devil sperm. I mean, I, he fucking busted in the lady and rode out. So I mean, I guess it's not that potent. Look at Dante. Fucking love this guy. Well, well. Do these guys ever age? Because like, if you think about it, they're demons. They shouldn't be able to to age when you when you get down to the nitty gritty. Humanity. That's true. But like, how long can they stay alive? How long can they stay strong? That's that's a question that, you know, I've always wondered is like, you know, Dante's gone for fucking a bajillion but he's been stabbed in the heart. If he doesn't if he doesn't feel fucking organ failure, then technically he can live forever, right? Technically, technically, because if he's been stabbed in the chest with fucking a million swords a bajillion times, I don't actually need to win this. Do I? Yeah, I don't need to win this. It would be cool if I did, though. I'll just fucking spam this thing. Oh, bing, 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 ding, 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 ding. Oh, I got a savage out of this? No, yeah, I think I think Dante can live forever. I think Dante and Virgil can live forever. I think Virgil Nero is gonna live forever. But no, Nero's because if Dante and Virgil are half half demons, 
because they had a human mother, then Nero is a quarter demon. That would fucking suck. If even even still he would be probably able to outlive Kyrie. That's sad. That's kind of fucking sad when you think about it. Like, you know, even though you're a powerful fucking being and you can take on like almost anything in your in your path, you still can't stop, you know, a time from progressing. That's interesting. And if he has a if he has a son, wouldn't he be like an eighth? He would be an eighth of a demon. If that's even a thing. Hey, are they going to go that far? You ever think? You know? Are they going to go as far as to create a, a fucking third generation? Oh, brother. The dead weight cutscene, dude. Alright, let's run it. I'm ready. I'm here. Having a good time. By the way, guys, if you are enjoying the stream, it would... Help me out a lot if you guys could consider subscribing to the channel if you're enjoying the content. I do playthroughs of a bunch of different games. I've, I've just been lately playing uh, Devil May Cry. But um, as a matter of fact, I, I've I've kind of... I don't know if you guys remember Fable. But um, I was able to get Fable 3. And I've been playing that a lot lately. And I've been having a really good time playing that. I also have uh, Outer Worlds that I, I started playing again. Um, uh, Assassin's Creed Valhalla is going to be coming out soon. So is uh, De uh, Demon Souls. I'm obviously going to try and play the uh, Virgil DLC, the actual DLC made by Capcom. Uh, so it's it, it'll be really cool if you guys enjoy stuff like that. Then I will be playing that in the near future. If you do, if you guys do like you know interesting commentaries. Wow, that sounds kind of pretentious. <laughs> I, I I like to think I'm an interesting person. Um, but yeah, I I do commentaries. I just do little playthroughs, and I you know I'm here cracking jokes, having a good time. I'm just I'm just a guy playing video games, trying to have trying to have a good time, trying to have make the best out of it. Trying to have make best out of it. Yes, fantastic English. Oh, we saw this in the trailer. All right. Oh, there you go. Virgil's just so sick looking. I hate the Furies! If I just keep doing that, will that... What if I just do this? Oh my god, I actually killed him. Thank goodness. I love how the Judgment Cut end just literally gives you immediately, in the snap of a, of a finger, uh, a triple S rank. That's the funniest damn thing. I love it. Remember guys, if you haven't known this already, you can get the Kalina Ann here. I'm pretty sure everybody and their mothers knows that. That's, that's like, that's, that's knowledge that's akin to uh, relevancy. The same as like uh, Dark Souls 3's tree hopping glitch. Or not, not even a glitch, but just like exploit. It's related to that. In, uh, in, in how often people, or not often, how, how well known that exploit is. Hello? Oh my god, the Judeca! I've never fought you before. There we go. Man, I'm flying by. I'm flying by Dante Must Die. Wow, bars. Okay, hold up. <laughs> I'm an unintentional rapper.
Come on. Yeah, so I have iframes. I still don't understand why I'm listening to Nero's music. Oh, these motherfuckers killed me. That was interesting. Now I'm a little motivated. Alright, let's run it. Let's try this again. Oh my god, you know what? I'm so excited to play Ghost of Tsushima again as well. Because... Um... That's another game that I, I've been really wanting to play, uh... A Ghost of Tsushima Legends. But unfortunately... Um, I don't have my PS4 anymore because I sold it to save up for the PS5. Hold up. Awesome. Smoking sexy style. <laughs> Just fucking brr, 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 brr. Look at the city guys. Look at that. We're in a giant pit Kind of interesting you never really uh Usually you never really take the time to, to look at stuff like that Can a guy catch a break? I just woke up from a long-ass nap Oh, we're gonna fight Cavalier Let's see it. Let's see it This man really threw a motorcycle at me. Of all the things that you could throw. Is it Halloween already? No, Halloween actually just passed. Oh, no. <clears throat> looks a little big. I thought you had better taste than that. How about I take it in a little? So anime, but it's just so cool. I fucking love Dante. I can't believe that. He really was not ready. Can we do it again? Can we see it again? He did it again! He did it again! He wasn't ready! <laughs> he did! Oh, this motherfucker got me though. Okay, hold up, hold up, hold up. Uh, blah, 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 blah. give me a second. You know what? Fucking let's lose. Let's use a, a gorb. I feel like we never use gorbs. I have like a hundred. Yeah, I have a hundred and ninety-three or four at this point. Fuck it, bro. Did I even hit him at all? Oh my god! Why is he doing that? Ooh. 
My goodness, this guy is taking it in on me, bro. Gorb. So we use a triple Gorb. Let's go. That was sick. That was sick. I definitely like this boss fight a lot. I think this is one of the better ones of the of the game. I like this boss fight and I like the Virgil Virgil Foss fight. Good job. Just slashing this dude with no care for fucking Trish inside. Fantastic. You gotta love it. Mother. Whoa, looks like I took it a little too much. You okay? Uh, I've been better. I want Dante or Virgil to hold me like Dante, that. that demon is... Don't even think about it. Just rest. Dante. <laughs> I like. I I always loved how V is just like wait, please. Please! And then he falls down. The Virgin V versus the Chad Dante. Oh, I'm talking shit about, about Lexi's emo god. I gotta I gotta calm down. I'm sorry. Look at that! He just he just he's just like, oh shit, I guess there's just a fucking naked lady on the streets. Fuck it. I'm gonna find this random blanket and just toss it over her. Where do they find these perfectly clean blankets? I don't understand. Do they just carry one in their back pocket? Just in case we find somebody. Dante's left. Yeah. And he's just reading more. He just he's just sitting on a couple of tires. Demon bee. Where did it come from? Urizen is not a demon. I know that I feel like V just has like his nose is kind of straight, but it's just like it's it's so it oh protrudes God. a lot. What are you? His face, his face it protrudes. Matter. It's kind of like he kind of looks like fucking Phineas from Phineas and Ferb. Like his face is just like it triangles outwards. I wonder if the focus meter will be in a five SE, especially now since Virgil has two finished moves, finisher moves that he can seemingly use outside of DT. That would be interesting to see. I, I definitely, I think that they're taking everything into consideration because they're like we're not going to give another half-assed virgil like i think the last virgil that we were able to play as was no 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 hold up because in in dmc devil may cry um they released a virgil dlc virgil's downfall but didn't didn't dmc 4's virgil come in after that DLC dropped or some shit like that? I'm not sure. I, I always, I can't remember the, the timeline of that, but, um, what was I saying? Uh, after, after DMC four, I'm pretty sure a lot of people have a, a high standard. They're like, Hey, we, and I'm, I'm pretty sure it's soon team was, is they have the same, you know, ideas They're They're like, Hey, you know what? If we're gonna, if we're gonna bring back all of these characters for this game, like when they were first making this game, if we're gonna make all of this, all of this uh, fan service, we might as well make everything as good as it possibly can be. And they have for the story. The story was amazing. Breaking down. And so I would imagine that they would do the same for for Virgil, bringing him back for a DLC. They would make him as strong as possible. Hey, that's me. Brother. You know, I have a katana, but the 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 hilt, the scabbard, is white. But like my uh my my hilt is white as well. I've always kind of thought about I was like, man, should I just fucking spray paint my my scabbard black? But then I was like, no, that would be disrespectful, because the people that made this katana like worked really hard on it. My katana is actually, quote unquote, not quote unquote, quote battle ready unquote. There we go. That's how I would say it. It is sharp as hell, bro. 
I could slice through a dude like butter. Home invasion, what? Catch me doing the fucking judgment cut <laughs> to whoever fucking tries to break it. <laughs> It's Darth Shittius. Oh my god. Quick, Lexi, look. Lexi, quick. It's Emo God and he's naked. Get your fill while you can. What you see versus what he sees? <laughs> If you think about it, he just nutted. He was like, "Oh my God! Oh, my demon side came out." <laughs> what little demonic power I have left, but I'm approaching my limit. In separating and regaining my human soul, I the edgiest thing that you can do is raise your hand to look at it and contemplate your your you know well being. A great movie where they have an emphasis on hands as symbolism is um Only God Forgives. It's a it's a movie that has um it's a, a movie by Nicholas Winding Refn and uh, it stars Ryan Gosling and he, I think he's in like a, a Vietnamese town or or a, a Thai town. I can't, I can't remember. But it's like he's I don't I think he's like a fucking bouncer or some shit like that. Or he's like a bodyguard. He has fighting experience. But he looks at his hands constantly. And you need to see this through. Dante's war. I feel like Trish and Lady are the most useless people in this game. Where in like the past games they were actually they had some merit. Wacky Woohoo Pizza Man! <laughs> huh? I guess. At least, like, in the other games. Like, in one, she was a, a plot point. She she had a purpose in the story. Um, and Lady had a purpose in DMC3. But, like, in this game, I feel like they're just here to be cameos. And they don't really contribute much. Like, I... In DMC4, they, they added a DLC where you could play as them, but I don't think there was, like, a storyline for them or anything. Don't mind if I just, uh, run by you guys? Sorry. I do not want to fight. I'm a very passive man. I've changed since my, uh, my edgelord humanity. Oh my god, he's trapped. He's trapped a dummy. He can't chase me in here, right? All right, let's just let's just hit a, a judgment cut real quick. Get people a little low on health. Ow! These motherfuckers killed me. No, they didn't. No, they didn't. Look at my health. What the hell just happened? Use a gorb. What the hell just happened? I bugged out. Okay. I was stuck in a idle animation purgatory. Let's go. I've been getting a lot better with Virgil. I've noticed. I've I've been able to like pull off a couple of more combos than I used to. It's still kind of difficult, though. I won't lie. If I examine this as Virgil, will I talk as Dante? I won't. That's unfortunate. What is fortunate is that I can just... Can I just zoom out of here? Hold on, where do I need to go? Look at this. Look at this, babouche. I don't have to fight anybody. Eh, 
Eh, damn it. There we go. Then, oop. Take you out real quick. I love it, I love it. I love it, it's so cool. The only issue that I'm gonna have is that I'm not that OP. Uh, but actually no, you know what, I, I like a challenge. I do, I really do. And, you know, to have the ability to be able to, to, um, the ability to be able, to have the ability to pull off, uh, crazy combos is gonna be really nice. With a much more refined character, because while, you know, while this mod is, is really, really good, um, and the people who worked on it did a fantastic job, it doesn't, you know, it's not perfect. It's, it still has its bugs. Like everything, you know. Nobody's perfect. Nothing is perfect. Except Hugh Jackman. That's my father. Buy a Laughing Man coffee right now. I'm his sponsor. Is everything full? It is! I can just go! <laughs> I'm in the catacombs. There's also a mod to replace uh, Dante with Virgil as well. So I might try to get that. Look at me just fucking zooming, dude. This is ridiculous. This is... First time seeing Special Edition. It looks like Nero's theme is playing when you are Virgil. You are. This is actually... <laughs> this isn't This isn't the Special Edition. Not yet. Not yet. Um, this is actually a mod. Although you could... It, this could be just a fucking r slash whoosh right here that I'm just like not aware of. But, yeah, just in case, just in case, if if it's a joke, it's funny, and I laughed, but if it's not, then this is actually a mod. I'm not actually playing the special edition. It would be sick if I got a copy early, but they don't even know who the fuck I am. <laughs> not a lot of people do. <laughs> I'm just playing through the campaign, because I was like, hey, you know what? I think it would be pretty interesting. I think it would be pretty fun to play through the entire game as uh, Virgil. Unfortunately, uh, for one of the missions I was unable to, so I had to play as Nero. But, you know, it's okay. You are absorbing the Sparta! Hold up, hold up, hold up. Are we gonna get a, a view from- Yeah! Double cheeked up! Double cheeked up Dante, bro. Fuck yeah. So do you think that their- their family home was in the fucking, uh... Was in Redgrave City? Because if if their home was able, uh, if they were able to find their house on the Clyphot, then the Clyphot started in Redgrave City. So it has. So by that, I don't know. Maybe I'm just crazy. That bird is strong as fuck. You can do that, but you can't carry V's skinny ass for more than five seconds. Unbelievable. All right, so I'm playing as. Dante slash not really. I'm playing as Virgil. I'm playing as Virgil against Virgil. Dante. So.
so cool. Can I actually beat him? I'm not Dante. <laughs> Does that do nothing to the fucking... I don't think it does. Damn. So... That does less damage. Do I have to beat... Uh, this guy? What if I just... Why would you do that? No, yeah, that's not working out. Okay, so I actually have to land a hit on him, or I have to beat him, in order to, uh, in order to do this. It's just so difficult because, like, it's so wonky. I'm OP as hell. Now you got me again. Just use- just keep on using Gorbs. <laughs> we can do this. Ah! Ah, come on, let me- let me hit! Let me hit! Come on! No, you motherfucker. Come on, come on. There we go. I'm just gonna keep on doing this real quick so I can- I can fucking... <laughs> so I can get his health low really, really quick because... One more time. Oh, no. I could just shoot at it, right? I mean, I guess. No, fucker. <laughs> this guy's kicking my ass. To be fair, this is just like super wonky. I don't really care about dying and wasting orbs and fucking, uh, you know, getting S pluses because I've already, I've already gotten all the ranks that I needed to. I've already, I've already actually gotten all the achievements in the game. So I, right now I'm just playing for fun. I'm just playing to try and like, you know, beat this guy really at the end of the day. That's, that's really what I'm trying to do. So just for you guys to know, I'm not bad. I just don't care. <laughs> if I go down and I waste a bunch of orbs and scare like that, like there's, there's no... It's no skin off my back, you know? I don't even think that's a real... That's not a... <laughs> is it... Is it back? I'm not sure, man. I don't know. Wow. 
Why is this thing so hard to break? Thank God. And then do a couple of these. <laughs> oh my God, he just fucking popped it out again, dude. Ridiculous. Yeah, so the judgment cut doesn't do anything to, uh, Oh lordy, this is gonna be a long fight. What if I just do that? What if I just run around him with my fucking summon swords? And I just shoot at the thing. Will he actually be able to hit me? <laughs> I, th I think it's working. I think this is actually working. I got smoke and six style out of this. Oh my god, this is gonna take forever. Uh, and yeah, and some of the animations are just like, they took- they take way too long. Damage enemies around you and completely refill- yes, please. The more I can do to this fucking thing right here, the better. Come on. There we go. Yes, I did it! <laughs> After fucking 90 retries, I finally killed his ass. Let's go. All this time, and you still don't get it. Yurizen really said, No, you! <laughs> Uno reverse card! And then whoop de woo wabby doo bro. We gotta fucking do it all again. Why does Lily look like this? Shouldn't she be in like her armor or whatever? Or not armor, but her outfit. I never understood this either. Trish is a demon. She should be super fucking powerful. Holding on to a person should not be like, she shouldn't even be struggling. So cool. This inconvenience matters not. Could you imagine jumping through a fucking waterfall of a a waterfall of blood. You know how disgusting that would be? You know how disgusting that would smell? What if you got it in your mouth? You know he did. You know he did because he was he was gritting his teeth. He was angry. So he ran through with his mouth a wide fucking open. Well, looks 
Looks like no one's worse for wear. <laughs> I'm just gonna double check. Hey, where did that garbage god go? What is yours in after? He's at the top. I'm the Clyphod. It's the other way around, Dante. This is the lowest level of the Clyphod's upper echelon. Human blood is the source of demons' power. The fruit born through the Clyphod is even more dense than the blood that created it. Its power is unparalleled. Even the Almighty Mundus used it to become king of the underworld. A V told me everything. Yeah, well, that's a lovely story and all, but as long as we know where to find them. Whoa, you! Are the infamous Dante? Um, <clears throat> I'm Nicoletta G Goldstein. Sound familiar? <laughs> um, my grandmother is Nell Goldstein. The, the gunsmith that made all your fancy weapons that you've got sat back there. <laughs> Yeah, there she is! <clears throat> mm, you don't much look like her. Yeah, I got my looks from my daddy. That's about all I got from him. But based on his research, I, I, I managed to cobble this. Um, it, it, consider it a gift in honor of us finally meeting. Um, meeting. It's interesting that after seeing the official Virgil gameplay PC mod Virgil is kind of meh. I know it is after seeing like the legit thing. It's it just it makes me want to play it more in my mind. But I, like when I actually play it, I just I'm like, damn, this is kind of like luster. I wish I could do everything that this game is doing like or like this uh this gameplay trailer is doing. But unfortunately, we have to wait. We gotta wait. I'll take that. Dante. He doesn't even know what it does. Go too. He d he just danced with it. This one out. Oh. Dante danced with the hat, and he was like, yeah, "I'll take this." I've got all the power I need, right here. You don't understand. It's not what I mean. <laughs> Let him go, Dante. Why did why did fucking V say it like that? Let him go, Dante. We must chase after. Oh, deep ass voice. Look at you, cracky ass skin. I mean you're going to. I have a duty to see this through. Dry lip, have an ass. Well, Don't try and lick him now. Mr. Poetry. I'm gonna go my way, and you guys can go your Mr. Poetry. Let's just say that's the best for the cause. Bye, Dante. Bye, father. This dude's fucking flaking. He has goddamn dandruff. I am excited though. I am very excited for uh Yeah, so I guess my mod didn't actually install which is kind of garbage I, I was kind of hoping that it would but I guess it just didn't um hmm I want to try and see I'll get next gen whenever I can I'm getting the Virgil DSC for current gen I don't care if it doesn't include achievements. I'll get next gen whenever I can yeah, I I was um I was saving up for a PS5, but now that I have the game here, really, you know, having a legendary Dark Knight mode and and Turbo mode added, like as extra things, uh, they have to they have to really sell me on that because to buy the the whole game again, just to just just to have Virgil, you know, I could easily just get the DLC on the PC and be fine with it, in my opinion. I'm getting the PS5 mostly for uh, Demon Souls and and other you know PS5 exclusives and, and whatnot, uh, but yeah, it's it's interesting. It's very interesting. Um, what I am gonna do real quick is uh, I hope you guys do not mind. I am going to actually close my thing here. What I'll do so you guys can actually see what I'm what I'm up to. I'm gonna go and I'm gonna see if I can if I can get the mod that uh allows me to change um that allows me to change the whatchamacallit. So DM Steve 5. 
mod nexus because i remember i have the mod here i have uh if i go into documents and i go to games this i have complete replaced v with virgil but it doesn't work so i'm just gonna delete that real quick and then i'm gonna go here i'm gonna wait what so it's not here i never even i never even enabled it i'm a crackhead Bury the light, crimson code, Dante. Blah, 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 game. Blah, blah, blah. Well, that's okay. You know what? Because we we need a we need a fucking. There's one where you can replace both Virgil and um and Dante. So let's see where is that? It's around here somewhere. Virgil chair, love it. Uh, blah, 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 blah. He has to be around here somewhere. Playable Virgil. We'll swap V. Oh my god, he looks so bad. Uh, yeah, I'll do it because I'm addicted to this game, so it gives me an excuse to complete it again. I'll buy it on a sale, though. No way I'll pay full price again. Yeah, that that's something that, that really is just kind of like, it bugs me. Um, is that really, like, games are... They, game companies are, are, getting, are getting greedy because even though... It's a measly $10 extra. $60 was already a lot of money. And it, it's kind of fucked up that really that money is just going to the executives. It's not even going to the developers. If it was going to, if the $70, if a, percent, if a larger percentage of that money was going to developers for them to, you know, create higher quality products, then I would be all right with it. But... It's just executives being money hungry and they're like, yeah, let's leech as much money as we can. And they're probably going to still pay developers the same exact amount of money. And they're going to be laying off people. They're going to be laying off people left and right. And they're going to be taking big old salary fucking boost for themselves. That's just ridiculous. That's something that I can't get behind for, for new gen or for next gen uh, uh, consoles and games is that they're, they're trying so hard to, to push this, this agenda of like, yeah, you know, we, these games are higher, are higher fucking cost production and stuff like that. So you need to pay more, but it's, it's not, it's not that it's just that you just want our money. And it like, I don't know, it, it doesn't make any sense because for them to make the games, it doesn't take that much extra. Um, okay, so let's see. Track the mod manager to any direct. So this will swap V or Dante for Virgil. All of their moves are unchanged. Only the characters, models. X Virgil skin now supported. Simply select the X alpha. Okay, so I can just download this real quick. Imagine if Virgil's taunt at the end of uh, Bloody Palace was the plastic chair. Dude, they have to. They fucking have to. If they don't, I will riot. I swear. Are Xbox games $70 too? Damn. Yeah, I think they are. Demon Souls is $70. Um hold up. Let's let's see. Let's let's actually look it up. $70. Who who's are yeah, are video games about to cost $70? Um Yeah. Yeah, I remember back when I was younger, games used to be around $30 to $50. I remember that. I remember my brother, my big brother, going into Toys R Us to buy a, a, a an Xbox game, like a classic Xbox, and that was like thirty to forty dollars, and so were the the Nintendo games, and then they bumped it up to fifty, and then to sixty, yeah, into the PS3 and Xbox 360. Yeah, that was in mid two thousands. Uh, microtransactions fucked everything up too. Yeah, exactly. Halo 2 sold a CD containing new maps for the game. Um, they gave V a lightsaber. They have to give a plastic chair to Virgil. Bro, they have to, dude. They have to. But, but CD Projekt Red's game is not going to be uh, $60, to be honest. Uh, what I think, what I genuinely think is the issue is that people continue to buy um, deluxe editions and golden editions. And they feed into that corporate fucking scam because you're paying a whole $30 extra, sometimes even $40 extra 
for content that doesn't fucking matter. You're paying for cosmetics, for slight upgrades, for an OST or some an art book. That's not fucking worth that much. It's not. The only game in recent in recent times that I've purchased as a digital deluxe edition was uh, Ghost of Tsushima. And even then, that was $70. They gave me a shit ton of stuff, but it wasn't like fucking $40 extra like Ubisoft does. Cyberpunk is never coming out, and never, and so is Elden Ring. Elden Ring and Cyberpunk don't fucking exist. <laughs> they don't exist anymore, guys. I'm sorry. The main reason why I want to download this is because I really want to see fucking Dante do the, the Dr. Faust dance. Or uh, Virgil do the Dr. Dr. Fouts. Fucker bounce. Don't 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 pick the don't. <laughs> God damn it! I usually buy base editions and only if they release good DLC with achievements, I get the season pass on a sale. That makes sense. That makes sense. For me, I do the same thing. You know, I try I try to to go everywhere to find the best price possible for anything, because I like, you know, not only is money tight, of course, you know, I I'm. It's hard to, to come by money during, during this fucking pandemic, but you also have to think that some of these games aren't worth that much money. Like, Watch Dogs Legion is fucking $60, right? But it's like, it has so many bugs, and it's such a lackluster story. It's a, it's a, it's a B-list game. You would, you would expect better from AAA companies, but it seems like they're, they're saying... Hey, we can put out B-list games and still get triple A money. And they do, and people fall for it, and it's so fucking stupid. Alright, it's uh 166 out of 250 megabytes. We're almost there. And so he said. Yes, I want to see this. I want to fucking see this so bad. Um He said. Extract both folders into ModZip. Start my name. Can I do for both? Oh my god, could I do it for both? That would be so fucking funny. I'll just have like three Virgils. That would be so funny. That would be so funny. I want to see that. There's a post of Virgil doing the Faust dance on, sub on the subreddit. You know what? That's true. But like, I want to see with my own eyes. I need to. I need to. That's something I really like about the, um, whatchamacallit. What was I going to say? I don't know. I'm cracked out sometimes. Sometimes I, I'm in the middle of a sentence and I just completely forget what I'm saying. Okay, and then downloads, and then, uh, let's extract this here real quick. Do they have Nero yet? No, they don't. That's unfortunate. Oh my god. Oh my god, this is so bad. This is so bad. Hold up. Virgil replaces Dante, Virgil replaces V. Oh. Oh, this is gonna be glorious. This is gonna be glorious. I wanna watch that scene again. I wanna watch this cutscene again. Everyone is Virgil in cutscenes too! Oh my god. Watch Dogs was never that good, but it, w it was decent. I enjoyed 1 and 2, but I'm really disappointed to hear that Legions is that bad. Legions, it's just, when, when you make a game, when you make a story that doesn't center on a character, you don't, have, you don't have an attachment. That is what a story needs for you to enjoy something. A, a, any, any production, whether it be a movie, a, a show, music, it needs to have something that you can relate to. And if you don't have that, then you don't feel a connection, you don't feel emotions, it, it's, it doesn't trigger any, like, happy feelings. Look! Look at them! Look at the fuckers! <laughs> what happened to V?! Look at his <laughs> Look at his face! It's missing! And Dante's over there just fucking staring at me. This is hell- oh my god, this is gonna be great. This is gonna be great. I need- I need to watch this cutscene again. Um... Personally... Personally, and I know a lot of people are going to be like, oh my god, what? I liked Watch Dogs 1. I thought that Watch Dogs 1 wasn't like the craziest story. It wasn't going to blow anybody's mind. 
I didn't think it was as bad as people thought it was. I think people thought it was really bad because of the, um... Oh, I should probably take off display capture so I don't have, like, two overlapping things. Um, people thought that it was bad because of the, the Ubisoft E3 downgrade in graphics. And that's why people disliked it. Alright, thank goodness. I can, I can do this. Yeah, that recruit everyone was worrying me since I read that. That's, that's what I said too. Because if you had a, a more dedicated squad of people to, you know, become attached to, to have a group of like, of fucking elite specialists that are cool and interesting. Ew! What? Why does he look like that? Why the fuck does he look like that? What the fuck? He's missing text. I'm just gonna double check. <laughs> what does he look like? <laughs> Can he not have two Virgils at the same time? I'm the Clyphon. It's the other way around, Dante. Why do they look like that? Level of the Clyphon's upper echelon. Dante looks fine. I'm thinking it. Look up Watch Dogs John Wick on YouTube. Watch Dogs One has its own Donguri. Dude, it's fucking sick. I've seen that. I know exactly what you're talking about. I've seen that video, and it's super cool. You know the things that you could do in Watch Dogs One were really cool, and it grounded you because it gave you a serious story and it showed you that there were stakes. Not stakes as like eating stakes, but like you know things at stake. In two, I think they try to take a more comical tone to show like a more rebellious kind of like fucking punk uh, vibe. But it fell short because it was like there you didn't feel like anything bad was going to happen. You felt like, oh, the, the heroes are always going to win at the end of the day. Nothing bad is going to happen. No one's going to die. There needs to be some suspense. Why the fuck did he look at her like that? <laughs> Trish is mommy? Oh my goodness. Mother. I mean, technically, Trish is the mother. <laughs> Bloating Virgil hair is scaring me. This is great. I, I want to see this so bad. <laughs> yeah, it just fades through his head. What the fuck? His hair is just down. This is the best thing I've ever seen in my entire life. <laughs> Could you imagine Virgil and his stoic ass doing this? His teeth clip through the fucking thing. Mother. Dante. No, I'm Virgil. I'm your dad. Spending some quality quality time with my son. Did you call me dead weight again? No thanks. I've got all the power I need. I feel like they could have given Nero a little bit more uh you know, conviction for a different thing rather than I, Who the fuck is this? <laughs> Floating Virgil here. <laughs> I mean you're going to <laughs> Nero's just looking at him like this what, the fuck? what the fuck am I looking at? Mr. Poetry. I'm gonna go my way and you guys can go yours. Let's just say that's the best for the cause. This is hilarious. Is he gonna zoom up on his face? That's the funniest damn thing, I swear. I love it. I love it. Okay, so I can I can go X color. Let's do that. Oh my god. Shit kills me, bro. It's hilarious. I love it. It's the best thing on planet Earth. Um so I'm still playing as Virgil, right? On the DMC fucking trainer. No, don't close that out. I need that. So mission start. There's a fly in my cup. I mean he was in my he was in my cup, but he didn't touch me. Extra protein, just chew on it. Yo, what if I did... Oh, wait, hold up. Can I see him in this one, too? If our positions were switched, would our fates be different? He has a nasally voice. 
Would I have your life? You mine? I know V was getting kind of fucked up at the part of the game, but damn! <laughs> he just disappeared! I want Beowulf! I want to do real impact. I got an apocalyptic. It's a giant thing. Oh, don't hit me again. Hmm? Um, if it's if it's the small little tub, then that's I'm not sure. Was that one open? If, if the one that you were using this morning was already open, then that one is yours. And I put that one back behind our fridge. If, if, it, if she can't find it, then it's on the... I brought- I- I put it back. It was next to the Metamucil, and then I put it back because I thought- Did you- did you take it before? Did you bring it down before? No, okay, so then I put it- I put the wrong one back. Then- then that's- that's the one over on top of the fridge. Because we have the same exact one. Mmm, for mother. Okay, there we go. I need to do this for mother. I need to show my dad. No, Virgil, Dante is is mother, and then uh, Virgil is papa, dad. If you guys have have seen uh, Super Best Friends play, that's the uh, I know, bro. I know PC mod Virgil has a faster judgment cut in DT. Use DT. I completely forgot he had real impact too. He's way too broken, bro. He's gonna be fucking disgusting. He's gonna be so nasty. Dunguri and fucking SS Smoke are gonna- Where did I go? I was just falling forever. I've never fallen that slowly before. I, it was kind of worrying at me. I, I was worrying at me. I don't know why I said it like that. Eh, eh. What if I just shoot this thing? Can I break this faster? <laughs> Just running around. There we go. Just get rid of you fuckers for a second. Let's try this one more time. <laughs> Is that it? Are you guys dead yet? Come on! There we go. Oh, I didn't have enough time. But I mean, I still executed the judgment cut anyways. Judgment nut!
There we go. Take care of these things real quick. And then we are on our way from misery to happiness today. Uh-huh, 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 uh-huh. Oh my god, there we go. The fucking... The whole squad is back together. Why is his mouth always open? Looks like we still got a long ways to go. How did one hole break under underneath of them and then they went three separate ways? Hey, I got an S. Let's go. Fuck yeah, bro. That's all I needed. That's all I fucking needed. I have a theory that the reason why they started making watchdogs and stopped kind of focusing on Assassin's Creed modern day story is because they were intertwining too much. Because a similar uh, thing that happened is, I don't know if you guys remember playing Prince of Persia, but that was a game that introduced free running and, you know, uh, fast paced combat with swords and whatnot. And then they made Assassin's Creed, which is pretty similar. And after a couple of installments of both, they stopped doing uh, Prince of Persia because Assassin's Creed was already too much like like that. They, why have two of the same brand? And so Assassin's Creed also has a modern day and a, and a history, uh, or a modern day and a past time like segment, a history thing. I don't know. You go into the past and you fucking fight as a historical figure. Not really. They're fake, but you get what I'm saying. Um, and so... What was I trying to say? Uh, oh, yeah, the the modern day portion of Assassin's Creed had a lot to do with rebellion and trying to, you know, fight against uh, a group of people that were trying to control the populace. And Watch Dogs had a lot of the similar, like, similar things. Um, and so after a few installments of both. Assassin's Creed stopped doing modern day. As we all know, because they killed off uh, Desmond and then the game started sucking. Oh, so I don't get. This is like a real boss rush because I don't get enemies to unlock. Or do I? I kind of do. There we go. I can't see. I I literally could not see. I was I was so confused as to what was going on there. Okay, let's use Gorb. Fuck it. You know what, bro? No, bro. You wanna you wanna play like this? Where'd he go? There we go. <laughs> he do he does it even in fucking in this fake form. All right, he's gonna do it again. Watch out! Watch out! And T pose. That's more like an A pose. Eh, I did it first. I love it. It's the it's the dumbest shit. Let's go. We did it, guys. Yeah, actually, I think after this mission I might uh might call it quits. 
I have a Mass Effect video that I need to edit in case you guys are interested in the Mass Effect series. Um, I think I'm one mission away from being done with the game. So there's going to be this next episode and probably one last episode, which is perfect because that wraps up any other like series that I need to do. Um, which is, you know, important because all things considered, I have a lot of series that I need to focus on. Uh, you know, in in recent, uh, or not in recent, in, in in an upcoming kind of like... I can't speak. What the fuck am I trying to say? I, I just sound stupid. It's not like I'm trying to say too many things at the same time, and I just can't figure out which one I want to say. Um, but yeah, I just, I have to do Assassin's Creed Valhalla, and then I have to do Demon Souls. Those are the two most notable things that I have to do playthroughs on, uh, because I want to. It's not that I have to, rather. Uh, but yeah, and what if I just hit him right now, bro? Let me just kill him. Kick my ass. I see you, I see you. Another Gorb. Or your Sorb. Me, I've completed every game on the RE engine and they're all amazing. Capcom releases Project Resistance. That was something that I was like, oh my goodness, dude. They were doing so well. They were doing so well. Capcom Capcom has a, has that thing about them. There was a revival. Um a couple of years ago because their games were just like becoming increasingly dog shit it was around the same time that they had uh resident evil 6 um because they had a lot of other games i can't remember at the time or i can't remember what it is right now but at that time they were, they were just putting out like very low quality games and after a couple of years, they had a revival. They had a lot of good, like, really, really good games coming out. Just, like, like bangers. And, um, you know, even now, they were doing a really good job. They were doing a really, really good job with uh, Resident Evil 2 Remake. And, and everybody was like, oh, my God, you know, think of the possibilities. And they went and made Resident Evil 3 Remake. But the Resident Evil 3 Remake was not not as good as it should have been. It actually felt worse to play that than it did for Resident Evil 2. It's like they they did a lot of copy and pasting, which of course naturally, you know, it's the same engine and it's the same type of gameplay that you're aiming for, um but they didn't add anything to make it feel a little bit more fresh. Um like the dodging was nice, but that was just about all that you could do. And everything was pretty much the same. And the enemies were kind of whack, and it just, like... Uh, there, were, there were a couple of mechanics, too, that they, they had taken off. Like, there was there was a lot less gore, I remember. Like, people had a, a, an issue with that. Like, when you shot limbs off, like, they... I don't know. They just wouldn't... Things wouldn't explode. Gore just wouldn't happen. Arms wouldn't just kind of, like, sludge off, and you'd see the tendons. It was just kind of whack. I played three in Black Flag. Uh, blah, 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 blah. I completed all the Assassin's Creed Chronicle games. I don't know what it is about them, but I love them. I've never played them before, but they definitely seem interesting. What is going on with my face? I just have no face. I mean, you can just see I'm flaking. See, that's what you get for looking at your hand cringily. Cringily? Is that a word? Not sure. Just shot him right in the face. That's it. <laughs> I used a gorb, guys. I'm sorry. I need to use them for something, bro. I keep... Like, every day I, I come in, and they're like, Yeah, you've gotten, like, ten gorbs for being rated stylish. And I'm like, thanks. I just... I have... I could fucking use Dr. Faust with gorb... With... Yeah, with gorbs at this point. 
Try ACC China. I liked it, but there's three of them, and the art direction is different for all of them, and they look amazing. I've I have been interested in the China one ever since I saw the the Assassin's Creed like cinematic short, um, Assassin's Creed Embers, which kind of like uh, documents the end of the life of Ezio, and you see June. Um, I forgot what her name was. I think it's Xiao Jun. Unless I'm thinking of some some other fucker. What if I... Can I do that? Well, oh, I don't take damage from that. Let's go. Oh, no, I do. Never mind. If I never touch the ground, can I just... No. It wasn't possible. Let's use this real quick. Look at this guy, look at this guy. Headline man teleports violently through life. <laughs> Could you imagine, dude? If you had this power, how sick would that be? How sick would that be if you're just fucking chilling? You want to rob a bank, you just fucking... Yoop, 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 yoop. Boom, rich. Easy. Nobody can fucking see wh wh what your face looks like. Or who you even are. At all, for that matter. And boom, you're a million dollars richer. I mean, obviously you're gonna need to uh, launder that money, but this is hot. This, this is pod racing. Hey guys, I don't actually want to fight you guys. Oh, I was, I was, I always want to try and break the game. I want to see if it's possible for me to like. So what happened? Oh! Small one. Of instant coffee. Yeah. I thought I brought yours down too. What happened? Okay. All these motherfuckers killed me. Imagine how weird it would look if you switch character models from DS DMC5 and RE2. Yeah, that's something that I've always been curious about, and I'm I'm surprised that at this point nobody has done that. Because if you think about it, it's the same engine. You could switch out Dante for Leon. I am a hundred percent sure. I'm a hundred percent sure. You know what? You could switch out Urizen for Mr. X. People just. I'm sure people have had these ideas, but they just haven't tried it yet. Hello, can I fucking move? There we go, sweet lord. These guys really out here fucking... Yeah, I'm moving super fast. Super fast, super fast, I'm moving super fast. Don't worry, I'm almost done. Mr. Urizen, dude, how fucking sick would that be? 
At that point, just make fucking Nemesis too. Why not? That would be cool as hell. Nemesis as yours in? That would be so cool. Why am I actually so, like, so much- Why do I feel so much better with this character now? <laughs> as I die. I say that as soon as I get fucking the last hit. I wasn't paying attention to my, my health bar. That's another thing, like, I feel like- I feel like that's why I die so much in this game is because I don't- I don't feel- I don't get the knockbacks, so I don't know- Like, I use that to kind of dictate when I- Like, that I should look at my health. Because when I get knocked back, I'm like, oh shit, I got knocked back. Let me see what my health is looking like at this point in time, during the fight. And if I don't get that, I'm just like, oh, I'm fine. I don't need to worry. I mean, sometimes I get, like, staggered, but I don't, I don't feel it. But they made a shitty phone game as a DMC3 remake. I dream about DMC1 and DMC3 remake. Oh my god, could you imagine? Could you imagine? That would be- that's- that's the next- that's the next step, really. Oh, uh, could you imagine DMC3 remake Virgil? That would be pretty rowdy, babouche. I will. Eliminate all. Stop running away from me! Oh, Yeah, I watch my HUD with peripheral vision and when I get hit on DMD, I'm like, Why did my green thing turn so red? Fuck! What in God's name? My own- my own copy of myself. There we go, that's how you end a fight. Hold up, because I want to see if uh, that chicken's the worst boss in the game. I hate her. They couldn't even make her hot like the hot. The bat lady from DMC3. Oh, you mean the fucking guitar chick? Was it? Was it Nevin? Revan? You no, Revan is fucking now. Kotor. What am I talking about? <laughs> you can come out. He fucking comes out no face. Hey, at least the body is fixed. Fixed. Fixed? The body is fist. I guess I owe you one. I guess I owe you one. Son. You should turn around. Your body's not gonna last much longer. As soon as they make a Nero one, 
You better believe that I'm doing fucking the whole series as as Virgil. Everybody's gonna be Virgil. Trish is gonna be Virgil. Lady's gonna be Virgil. And fucking Morrison's gonna be Virgil. And Nico's gonna be Virgil. Easy. She's not supposed to be hot. Nevin, yeah. Fine. The I don't know I don't know what the whole deal is with them making the fucking like making these enemies so seductive i do know why it is to exploit you're like we know we know exactly who we're tailoring to yeah it's a fetish they're like, hmm, mother. <laughs> oh my god. I feel that. But, uh, yeah, I think it's about time for me to call it quits. Because it's 341. I'm, I don't know if I'm hungry. I'm not sure. I really, I like, I can't, I can't think if I'm chicken fetish. <laughs> Ew, that's bestiality. But yeah, I am going to sign off for today. I just want to say thank you guys again. It's always very nice to see you guys here. Um, I'm not sure. We will probably finish the Virgil campaign, quote unquote, in, um, in the next stream. I'm not sure. What other games do you think I should play? Because I, I do think that the the halo 4 pc flight is still going on so i think i could still uh do a stream on that but i'm not sure i could i could try playing uh demon souls now that now that i i completed the series on my own or not not on my own um on on my youtube channel and i and i've done all the videos i can actually probably just play it now for shits and giggles um so I could do that. I, I have a lot of games. Hold up. Let me let me actually let me check. Let me close out DMC5 real quick. Um I have Rocket League, Halo, The Outer Worlds, Fable 3. I have been really enjoying Fable 3, but I don't know what the what the um demand for Fable 3 content is, so I don't think I I'll put you guys through that. I might do Outer Worlds. Outer Worlds seems like a, a good a fun game to stream. Um, good stream. Thank you, brother. I really do appreciate it, man. It means a lot to me that you guys come in here. You're having a good time. Um, let me actually face you guys. Real quick. Um, I just want to say thank you. I love you guys. And, uh, if you're not already subscribed, now would be a great time to do so. I'm probably going to have a YouTube video out tomorrow on Mass Effect. If you guys want to keep an eye out for that. Um, but you know, it's like I said, I hope you guys have a great day. Be safe out there. Stay healthy. Drink a lot of water, you know. And I will see you guys in the next stream. Or video. You never know what might come up first. Uh, my brother tried Fable 1 on Game Pass. And he just punched everyone in the village. That's, doesn't everybody? When you start off, you're just like, bro, let me just fucking knock everybody out. It's the best. Fable 1 is the best game. I will say that much. That is the best Fable, in my opinion. And I'm super hyped. For when they bring out uh, the the Fable soft reboot or some shit, I'm not sure what it is, but um, punches are unintentionally comedical in that game. I know because when you punch, you just fucking, doof, doof, doof. and the the people just like they they fly back with each punch. Just, whoa, whoa. It's great, I love it. It's the funniest thing. And then they run away and they scream. <laughs> you should always do a good and a bad playthrough. I think that's like. There's always a lot of fun to go both ways. Um, I've 100%ed Fable. That is my that is my game. Like I own that game. Um, Fable Fairy Eating Simulator, dude. Not even. It's when you eat the chicks, the crunchy chicks, the little chickens. That's how you get evil really fast. You just fucking you you go all the way towards the end of the game. You have a shit ton of money and you just fucking eat like 90 crunchy chicks. And then, and then you just become the most evil motherfucker, and then you're huge as hell because you're fat from eating all the chicks. But um, all that aside, all that aside, thank you guys again. I'll see you in the next one. Deuces. Take care. And thank you, Edward, for being here. Thank you.